Okay, YouTube, welcome to part two of uh, the uh, trailer lift jack. Uh, we're reassembling it. Um, I'm just going to start to put it together here. Um, I'm going to tie these wires up to the motor because the way that the thing goes back together. I mean, these don't have to be here, but it's just going to make it assembling it a little easier. Okay, now I'll kind of hold the wires up. And the reason I want to do that has to do with how these bottom two pieces come in, uh, like this here. And I don't want to be fighting and arguing with these wires here. So, there's the one side. And then here's the other side. Oh. Like this. So, and then there's a screw that goes through the side of the case here. Um and then some screws around the top to hold it. And for my dad who likes spade terminals better than he does bullet connectors, I'm going to go ahead and uh, put some uh, spade terminals to connect the uh, light up. Okay, now I'm going to struggle with this. Oh, there you got it. Got it. Okay. All right. I went ahead and tied that upper control panel up because uh, it was giving me a headache. So, anyway, you got uh, black with a light background. Virtually impossible to film. And I forgot the wire, so I'll tie this up again. Okay. So now this side. Okay. This has got this little grommet here. Okay, there's that side. I got another issue. I got to get my lights down there. Well, it certainly is a clumsy situation right here. I thought that was a hole all the way through, but it's not. Okay.
not very straightforward at all. Okay, holy cow. Okay, wow. Got that part done. Okay, the light. And Trying to put the screw in, and the camera is like right in the way. Man, whoever designed this thing, wow. Okay. This is revision too as well. You know, the metal looks really solid, but the plastic and the switches and stuff, you know, they were trying to save a buck somewhere. <clears throat> so the light cover serves to hold the clamshell together, the two sides. Wow, that was a challenge. Okay, so we'll take a break and we'll come back and we'll take about uh, took about putting the top cover on there. Okay, now to the switch plate. Uh, I'm just going to take this piece of steel here, cut this off, rivet it into the plastic, seal it, paint it, um, and then drill a hole for the uh, maybe not in that order, but drill a hole for the switch. Okay, so the switch calls for a half inch, a half inch hole, and I'll start off with three sixteenths because I have a bunch of those, and I even have a spare one up on the wall in case I need it. Um, I ran out of my other ones. Let's go ahead and get this set up. And I'm not being real high precision here. I am actually just doing this all by eye. I got rid of my drill press when I got the mill, just because I don't I don't have a very big shop and my drill press was all wonky and crooked. Okay.
It's going to go somewhere in between. This is uh, what? 20 I'll just step this up. Okay, half inch. We'll just put a quick coat of paint on both sides of this. Uh, Krylon indoor outdoor metal woodworker, exceptionally smooth, it's fast drying. We'll let that dry. And then uh, we'll come back. Okay, guys. I, on the camera, I don't see this at all. So I'm kind of thinking of black on black, whatever, is uh, may work. So what I'm doing right now is I'm just getting the super glue out. I'm going to temporarily attach this. Um, and then I'm going to pop rivet it. But just to get started, I'm going to go ahead and glue it into place. And don't get super glues on your fingers. Okay. I got a little clamp here that I'm going to use just initially. All right, we'll let that glue in there, and I'll come back and get some rivets on there. So this thing is clumsy as all get out. Okay guys, I'm actually really going to record me failing all over the place. You ready? Well, that bit must be trash because... Uh Just got to go slow. Okay, get a sharp drill bit. Shatter the plastic, right? That's the next thing we do when you tighten the rivet. We've got these washers that go on the back too. I'll get one rivet in there. That would be an awesome start. Didn't shatter the plastic. Excellent. Now that I got that one rivet in, I'm in good good shape. All right. So we'll go ahead and drill the other hole.
We got two in. Wow. Okay, two more to go. Last one. There we go. Alright. Okay, off to the next section. Cut and... Okay, so I've already checked the switch. And I know that it goes in there like this.
Okay, there's the light. 